All right, hey guys, it's Dr. Michelle here, and we're going to be um, playing some third grade questions. I am playing as first mate Devin. Um, let's look at, I haven't played first mate Devin in a long time, so let's see where we are. Let's hurry to the academy and teach the puppet master a lesson. We've got different things in Skywatch that we need to do, lots who have been rescued. Um, got to deal with some titans going on if our mind illusions won't if work, our mind we'll, illusions won't work we'll have to put a stop to your effort the old-fashioned way, old -fashioned way. This magic has the magic has survived for thousands, for thousands of years, of years. It, won't it won't fail now all right so we're not going to be a member for this for devon won't become a ma member so we're going to keep on going and let's see what we've got going on We are doing third grade shapes, identifying shapes. So it says, what is the best name for this quadrilateral? So just a couple of things for you to remember. When we come over here, quadrilaterals always have four sides. So um, we know that all of these are four-sided shapes. Technically speaking, if we really wanna, you know, be specific since I teach high school geometry, all of those are true okay it's just how it is all of them are true a parallelogram as you'll learn when you get to high school is any shape where the opposite sides are parallel and in this shape these opposite sides are parallel and we write parallel by writing little triangles tell us parallel so these sides are parallel so it is a parallelogram a parallelogram can be broken into a square or a rhombus Squares have the opposite, that's a rectangle. Rectangles are rhombuses. Rectangles have right angles. Rhombuses have all equal sides. And a square is like a rectangle and a rhombus got together and had a baby. So the best name for this shape would be a square. Although technically it is a parallelogram and a rhombus because the opposite sides are parallel and all the sides are the same, but they want us to pick square. All right, let's move on to the next question. Let's see how we can do with that. Yeah, clearly, I don't know what went on. Cold snap, Does that have any effect? Nope, no effect at all. All right, what's the best name for this quadrilateral? It's the same one that we had. We can see that there are right angles. Right angles look like the corner of a piece of paper. And we can see that the opposite sides, all of the sides are equal. So it would be a square. Technically, it is also a rhombus. And if you don't live in the United States, it's also a trapezoid. Trapezoids outside the United States have at least one parallel side. In the United States, we typically say they only have one parallel side. So they want us to still pick square. Let's see what happens now. Um, this was chill out. Excellent. Come on, come on. <sighs> all right, all right. Enemy's turn. Oh no, critical damage. Not good, not good. We'll go for an excellent star bit. Fighting back. Excellent chill out. Fighting back. Enemy's turn. No! All right, we got to do another question. What's the best name for this one? Okay, this is another one where it has two names. It is a parallelogram because the opposite sides, if they continue forever, will never touch. But it wants the best name. And the best name is, this also has right angles. So the best name is that it's a rectangle name but it's also a parallelogram all right let's see i'm going to do star bright is prop Ooh, you know what let's do cold snap still come on come on come on come on come on come on <gasps> we did a titan hit we earned 30 battle stars i don't have a membership so i'm not even going to bother opening up the member case yep whatever Continue. 
Well done. Well done. We ranked up in our prodigy. Awesome. Nice. Let's see what else is going on. Should we participate in the battle again? We've got a couple more questions to do. Let's do the battle again. I think I put seven questions on each one, so we'll just have this video end there. All right, it's our turn. Cold snap. Okay. Oh, I should have changed the pet since it's weak to leaves. All right, what's the best name for this quadrilateral? All right, well, we have one set of parallel lines. So because we have one set of parallel lines, the trapezoid is the best one. Remember, rec whoops, keep a trapezoid. Rectangles have two sets of parallel sides and right angles. And rhombuses have two sets of parallel sides, but all the sides are the same. So the trapezoid is the correct answer. All right, let's do again. Let's see what we're gonna do. Um, chill out seems to be the best one right now. Okay. Enemy's turn. Miss, 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 we'll take the misses. Thank you, thank you for missing, we'll go for it. All right, next question. All right, this is our parent shape. This shape is a parallelogram. It's a parallelogram because the opposite sides are parallel and the opposite sides are also congruent. Now, other things that you'll learn about parallelograms in the future is that the opposite angles in a parallelogram have the same measure. You'll also learn that um, the two angles on the same side will have a degree measure of 180, but you don't need to know that in third grade, but you do need to know that it's a parallelogram. All right, what are we gonna do? Titan fight, Skywatch Titan fight. I don't do the dice one, I'm a little bit nervous. Probably should pick something different. Ooh, it had critical, it had critical. All right, we'll take the miss. Thank you for missing. My turn, Darvick. Cold snap. Oh, so close. So close. So close. All right, what's the best name for this one? Well, we notice it is a parallelogram because the opposite sides are parallel. And these little V's making parallel. So that is true, but all of the sides have the same measure. And because all of the sides have the same measure or are congruent, this means that this is a rhombus is the correct answer. Now, if all the sides were congruent and had right angles, then it would be a square, but that is a rhombus. It's also a parallelogram, but the best name is rhombus. Oh, what are we gonna do? Chill Splinter. Yes! Skywatch Titan. Hit! That's what we're talking about. That's gonna always say be a member, but remember we don't have to be a member. It's gonna hit the brown case. It's no big deal. We have a lot of math to do anyway. Um, not gonna worry about leveling up faster. Thank you so much for watching this third grade video about shapes. I am Dr. Prodigy. Bye guys!